Welcome back, everybody. It's time to lock down some Pioneer Slivers. That's right. Haven't played Pioneer in a minute. Uh, we're up against Melvin Schroeder, and I have no clue what's going on in Pioneer, so I feel like every time I do come back to Pioneer, the meta shifted pretty rapidly, so I don't know what's going on at all, but this looks like a perfectly fine hand to keep. Not a huge fan of the double mana swift. But, you know, we got Gale Rider into um, Metallic Mimic, into a Sentinel, which is all nice stuff. Or however we want to play it, depending on our draws. But this looks fine. And I'm kind of... They got uh, Kiora, Master of Depths, as their little thumbnail. And it kind of makes me wonder, hmm, are we playing Merfolk? Are we going to go Tribe versus Tribe? No, doesn't appear so. They got a Rugged Highlands. Interesting. Another unclaimed. Okay, sure. We're just going to keep playing our unclaimed. That's fine. Oh yeah, we got to click this stupid thing again. All right, go. We've got a Gale Rider out. It might die. Maybe. Gruel aggro? Is that a thing in Pioneer? Not sure, honestly. Maybe they're just splashing that green. Ooh. Ooh, is this dinos? Oh, this has got to be some dinos, right? Okay, we're going to have to race a little bit, but that's not bad. Nice collected company. All right, so how do I want to run this here, really? I think I do want to go metallic. Go metallic. Next turn, we'll have three mana. Drop a mana swept into, like, a scent. Yeah, seems reasonable. Sliver, okay. Go for one. And pass. <clears throat> Another tap land that's good for us. We don't need them moving very fast. Although this looks like it's... Since they're playing with tap lands and not shock lands. Makes me think like... They're trying something else here. Alright, so Thunderherd, Migration. An additional cost, reveal a dinosaur... Or pay one. Search for a basic land card. And they revealed Big Dino. So we are up against the nice tribal versus tribal, but we got big boy dinos here. Uh, if it was kicked, it fights another target creature. Okay, good to know. So they're going to ramp for a minute. Sentinel is going to be pretty good in this matchup in case we do need to start chump blocking. Ooh, a leeching is very nice. I do like me the leeching. So, I think we're going to go Mana Swift. And we're going to go Leeching, Leeching, Leeching. First, get in for three. Gotta love that. Put him down to 17. Pass the turn. We're setting up for a really nice turn with a Sentinel, and then end of turn Collected Company. It's going to be beautiful. Unless they kill something here. Here comes the Allosaur Rider. Allosaur Rider. Doesn't have reach, though. Doesn't have reach. And they're tapped out. Thunder Herd costs two mana. It's fine. So... Maybe they play a land, play a Thunder Herd migration again. I don't know what they could do for one mana except play maybe another, like, uh, Rampy Boy. Savage Tom. Ha 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 ha. Oh, you dirty boy. Oh, that sucks. Uh, Alright, becomes a 6-6 six, six and just eats my boy. Unfortunate. Mm. Interesting turn of events. <laughs> we are going to play our Centennial here. Hmm. So do I want to just hold up Collected Company? I think I do. Yeah, let's just hold up Collected Company. We don't have great attacks yet. 
we're gonna hopefully we can like hit a lord or maybe another leeching or something and really like swing in for some good stuff Let's see if they want to swing they are passing through oh my gosh and we didn't do our collect company gosh dang it that's that's a bit unfortunate isn't it yikes all right well now we're just gonna beef our boys up a little bit uh, oops, cancel that, I guess. All right. Put down this. All right, they're playing Forerunner. Search your library for a dinosaur card, reveal it, then shuffle your library and put that card on top of it. If her dinosaur enters under your control, it deals one damage to each creature. Mm, that's going to be problematic. That's going to be problematic. Let's see what they get here. I am concerned for my board. Let's just not skip our collected company this turn. Needle Tooth. When it's dealt damage, it deals five damage to target creature and opponent controls. Okay, bet. Time for the collected. Gale Rider, Gale Rider, boom, bang, bing. I think we got it. Get the sli sliver. I can't, I can't. All right, that'll wrap this game up. We'll go to sideboard. Now, see, we could have had that win one turn earlier if we hadn't passed through our collected company. And my green screen is not happy with my teal shirt, as you can see. All right, sideboard. Is shapers necessary? I don't know. Hmm. Death Touch, I think, might be pretty good against them. Also, Life Link. Fatal Push is going to suck. Take out an Icon, take out Immortal. Keep in Sliver Hive Lord. And let's take out. I don't, I don't think. I don't. I don't think we can compete with First Strike on the. Well, no. We'll keep it first strike. Let's not be silly here. First strike is first strike. All right, let's go. Let's run it back like that. That feels good. All right, could have had the win a, a turn earlier, but it's all right. It's all good. Ooh, it was just that white light that was making me go all bold. All right, breeding pool. Diffusion. So we can go Gale Rider, Diffusion... Venom, hopefully drawn to another land, set up for our Silver Hive Lord. Keep. Down. Let's see. Let's see what we can do against these experimental dinosaur deck. I don't know. Is dinosaurs in the meta right now? It's. I loved the deck when it was in standard. Ixalan Dinosaurs was dope. It was so cool. I never had a chance to play it. I was too busy rocking Merfolk at that time, though. These tap lands are giving us a lot of leeway, though, that's for sure. All right, we are paying the two. Let's get the Gale Router down now. We got a Leeching, which is pretty dang nice, because I do want to get that down. But I think... I think I want to go to Fusion first. Maybe. Maybe not. Silverhive's nice. Do I want Diffusion, or do I want Leeching? I guess I'm gonna... I, I think they know the game plan here. They know Gale Riders are strong cards, so... Eh, it, maybe damage is more important here, but I think just setting up just in case protecting your Gale Rider is fine. I think it, you can make a case for playing the Leeching, though, first. 
But we'll play next turn. And then we'll play like a siphon. Because they're a bit away from getting any big boys down. So, works out pretty nicely. All right. Uh, they did not reveal a dinosaur card. All right. And they got a land of wars. Ooh, and they have one card in hand. Oh, this is a rough one for them. I hate to say it. Uh, that's great, too. All right. Let's get in. Oops. Wrong one. Oops. No. Don't concede the game. <laughs> Just want to put out another Gale Rider, that's all. Alright, swing for four. Let's get in there. Wrap this one up real quick once we put down our siphon, basically. Let me unmute again. All right, I don't think that uh, Trample Haste is going to do much against us here. Swing for eight. And then we drop a lifelink next turn. Sure. It's a lot of damage. Oh, we are so close to Sliver Hive Lord, too. It's crazy. We may have to chump block a little bit. Hmm. If they have another one of these chargers, we might not be happy. We go to 14, though. Chump block may need to happen, but uh, we got them pretty low. They are getting in. Makes me a little nervous. Uh, yeah, I am going to block. I don't, I don't know what they have planned. They have one card in hand. Maybe I shouldn't be that nervous at all, but... Can you play anything else with your one card? No, they can't. All right, GG's. Let's see what our card draw would have been. Another leeching. That would have definitely wrapped it up for sure. All right, well, hey, G's, 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 G's. Uh, nice dinosaur deck. I miss Pioneer. No one likes to watch it that much. No, some people do. Just not as much as Popper Slivers and... Uh, Pioneer was getting some low views. The, the views were tanking a little bit, but I don't mind playing it here and there because I do enjoy it quite a bit. So if you did enjoy it and you want to show the support for some Pioneer Sliver, show the support, leave a like, make sure to subscribe and leave a comment down below and tell me, hey, dude, play more Pioneer Slivers, all right? And spread this video around so I can get more views on it so I can commit more time to playing it. But all right, thank you guys. We will see you in the next one.